I got a call from one of my friends that were like, hey, they're looking for a coach to take over for the girls. One year I did that, and then the varsity boys coach opened up. So me doing that one year with the girls, I was like, nobody's giving us any love. Even though I'm the head coach, I'm like, I'm gonna make sure that we are together. My first year, I was new to this and just didn't come naturally. It felt like there was always a division. So we had a lot of conversations about what can we do. And at first, it was like we had a list a million miles long, and then we had to kind of trim it down. Us bonding with the girls was just a great idea just because the girls, we didn't want them to feel like they were just alone in the basketball program. So that's when I, it was just like, we, we should bond, we should all get together, and that way we got each other no matter what. At first they were, they were a little, yeah, but then like they got used to us and they realized like we were there for them. We went to a Michigan game, we went to Cedar Point, we have an alumni game that we play all together. I like the U of M game just because I love basketball. It's fun to see all of us get together and talk about basketball. Like as a son, knowing who's scoring, what fouls being called, who's stealing the ball. And it's fun, then we laugh about it. We make jokes about everything, we just bond. It just gives kids something different to do. You know, it's just do your homework, go to practice, have a game. You know what I'm saying? It's like, and with sports, the key thing for us, well for me anyway as a coach, is to build that relationship, long-term relationship. So like these outside of this, you get to see a kid in a different light. It's just exciting, especially from a coaching standpoint. So we have a mixture of kids that are normally in athletics or in band or choir. If they weren't together on the team, then normally they'd be in their little sections. And even with the boys and the girls, some of them may not have talked to each other outside of becoming friends here. When we mostly look at the crowd when we playing, we just see a full, all the girls there. Like We see it's a lot of people there but we mostly see the girls have their own section, I would say. And it feel good to have, us, have them support us. So we support them back. Like, we got y'all, we here for y'all, no matter what, win or lose. Just having them at the games, yelling in support. When you don't have your family there, you're really like not all together, but you can hear them yell your name when you do something good. So it brought us all together and we all became like a really close family. Everybody wants to be cheered for, and when it's coming from your peers, it sits a little different. You know, so it's kind of like when you hear like the girls cheering for the boys, I'm quite sure they get pumped up and like, you know, and vice versa. When the boys cheer for the girls, you can see them kind of like, yeah, like, and it's fun. It like helps us play better on the court because we get to see from like the boys' perspective. I used to not play basketball, so when I first started, I was like really bad. Like I couldn't dribble or anything, but like we have joint practices and stuff. And then Jawan, actually, he would help me with basketball. He helped me like learn how to shoot, how to do layups properly. He showed me how to like dribble better. So I've got a lot better since my first year starting and it's mostly because of the boys. Well, we help each other, get our handles better, you know, get our layups, just drills wise. We just help each other get better. And schoolwork, we, you know, so that way it, everybody can stay on track. You know, stay on the team, we help each other with schoolwork. Definitely a sense of community and pride, I think. Like when I first started here, it seemed like a lot of it surrounded different programs here, not necessarily the basketball program. And I think that bringing the two programs together, we're building a bigger community. I hope that these are people that they can reach out to forever. It's just basketball, let's, 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 let's not look at gender at all. The way our community is headed, I think it will be awesome for more schools to do it. I mean, it's just great for the sport, it's great for the, the building of character of girls and boys. It's by far deeper than basketball.